Yo, what's happening, people? It's Clossius X here. We've got another tutorial for you guys on the Skyrim Creation Kit. And today, we're going to make our own custom weapons and armor with their own enchantments and stuff. Custom enchantments. So, what you want to do first is um, on the left bar here, you want to drag it down to the armor and you want to find yourself like some armor that you want to duplicate. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to duplicate the chef gear that you get in one of the levels. So, just click on armor. And here's the gear that you get when you do that chef quest on uh, where you have to poison the guy. Spoilers. Uh, but yeah, just um, duplicate them. And then click edit on the top copy that you've done. And just type in 000 um, Gordon Ramsey. And then just name it to uh, Gordon's Tunic. That's right, that's how powerful this armor is going to be. Gordon Ramsay's tunic. So just type in the armor rate and put, I'm going to make these crazy strong, the 25. And then click OK. So at the moment we've got no enchantments on it, but we just want to get it set up. So edit that. 000 Gordon Ramsay hat. And then just call it. Gordon's hat. Yep, and then on the uh, armor rating, just choose 20. Super strong. Right, and then on the shoes, Gordon's, Gordon Ramsay shoes. And then just call it Gordon. Gordon slippers. Armor rating 15. Click OK, click No, and then click Yes. So now we've got a clone of the chef gear that we can edit. So what we want to do now is add our own custom enchantments to it. So go down to Enchantment, take off the chef filter, and then we've got all these different various enchantments that we can, these are ones that you can basically put on straight out the box. So what we want to do is we want to clone these and edit them slightly so we can make them a little bit stronger and stuff so what you want to do first of all is just have a little look at the enchantments on here and what you want on your your own enchantment so let me just check it out what we've got these armor here these are the ones that you get on the dragon priest mask so you probably want to get one of these for the hat so yeah let's clone one of these um, I'm not sure which one does what. Let's have a look. Water breathing, speech craft. Yeah, let's just duplicate that. Edit. And then for the ID, just put 000 Gordon um, hat spell. Yeah, enchant. E N C H. And call it Gordon's Rage. And then just delete the, uh, the effects. then just right click put a new effect in and choose one out of this list you want to get an enchant one fortify let's have a look fortify heal rate I'm going to put the magnitude up pretty high right so there's my regenerate health and obviously we're just doing this for as an example and now let's choose another one for the uh, the robe uh, magical rate 5 yeah that one let's do magical rate duplicate that edit and then call it 000 Gordon Ramsey and um, what's the what part are we doing the tunic tunic inch Name it Gordon's. Oh, I'm trying to think of a spell. Regenerates Magicka. So call it Gordon's Pork Chop. Pork Chop Enchantment. Obviously, this is just joking about. You can change it all to whatever. So Gordon Ramsay's Pork Chop. 
Don't even call it enchantment, just call it Gordon Ramsay's pork chop. Okay, no, yes. And one more for the shoes. Which one do we want? Absorb. Let's do absorb health. Yeah, that'll do. Duplicate, edit. I'm going to call it zero, zero, zero. Gordon slippers and chant. Gordon Ramsay's I can't even think of a name boiled eggs <laughs> this is the dumbest tutorial ever <laughs> absorb health right I'm actually gonna leave that obviously you can have more on so you can have more than one so Where's E N C H? There we are. We could do a bound weapon, but no. Turn undead. I think that is when they attack you. The undead turn. So let's just do that by twenty. Uh, Ten seconds. Confidence. Ah, oh, right. So I think I turned the undead to confidence or something. Save that and click no, and then click yes. Go back up to the armor and just type on the filter. Zero zero zero. We've got our things at the top. So double click on Gordon Ramsay. This is the body piece. So what we want to do is click on enchantment here, and then just we've got the tunic enchantment that we've just made. So click OK. Actually, on equipment type, not equipment type, on here you want to change it to light armor. Yeah, I'm going to make it a light armor. And for the hat, just put the enchantment as the hat. And then for the shoes. Ah, oh, where's my shoes gone? Just okay there, go back down. Let me just see what I've done with that. Right, armor, enchantments. Right, so it is there, Gordon Slippers. Oh, Gordon Slippers enchant. Let me just see why my uh, enchantment's not showing up. Alright people, that was an amateur mistake, a very, very amateur mistake. What I've done is I've put it down as a weapon enchant here, so... Yeah, that's why I couldn't put it on the armor, so let's just choose something else. Uh, fortify light armor, yeah, so I'm just going to duplicate that. Edit. Zero, zero, zero. Gordon's slippers edge. Fortify Gordon's slippers. Might just change the magnitude to a little bit higher, say 40. Right, that looks okay. Right, let's head back to the armor and get that armor piece put on. There we go. So, yeah, it was just an amateur mistake. So, click OK. Save that. Right, so let's go test that out. Alright people, so here we are in game. What I did was I put them on a table inside your Vasca. All you have to do is um, pretty much just drag the items from the armor tab onto the map. Um, where you are actually located and 
when you get in game hopefully it should spawn if you've done it right what I've done is I've put it over here on this table nicely spawned as you can see they're glowing as well because we put the enchantments on them so you've got red for health obviously green stamina and blue for magicka so let's um, just grab these let's try them on so apparel look at the air uh, buffs on them by the way increase your light armor skill by 40 points 100% magicka regen and 50% health regen so now we are Gordon Ramsay with massive gloves on because we didn't give him any custom gloves but yeah what we as, that is actually quite a powerful armor now so what we can do is because we're Gordon Ramsay we can create lots of food are you ready this is probably gonna crash sweet roll no it's not it's honey nut treat I think um, Ayla likes honey nut treats Right, should we try one more before let's see if it crashes? Let's try and spawn five hundred of them. It's gonna crash. Nope, it still hasn't crashed. Can't believe it's still running at fifty FPS. Well, you know, I am Gordon Ramsay after all, so you know. What's up, Ayla? I'm just gonna spawn another Let's try 400. Right, so yeah, that is pretty much it, guys. Um, if you want to follow along, feel free. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and hopefully I have a few more tutorials for you in the future. What I'm going to do next, actually, is do a weapon tutorial on how to make a custom weapon. And I'll probably do it to do with this, so I'll probably make like a fork or something like that, or a knife and fork that you can use. I think that are pretty awesome. But yeah people that is it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.